Hello everybody, this is Sparrows here, and today we're going to be doing some more Cell Singularity. Now, uh, today I think we're going to be going straight into it, with um, some of the more uh, entropy based things, because I haven't really got many of those. We get woolly coats, which is not... Okay, so then that leads to the mountain goats, which, yeah, that makes sense, you need wool in order to have a mountain goat. Um, <laughs> everything's so flipping expensive. Um, ooh, we can get this. Fix the glitch. Okay, it's it's expensive. Really expensive. Um, oh, lions. Okay. That's nice, I suppose. It's interesting that you have to fix loads of glitches in order to get this. Because for this one, you didn't really have to do that. You just unlock the ranks, and then that does it. Technically, these are, you know, glitches, but they're not quite, um, like, these are glitches which you need megabits to fix. So, is that different? It's weird. And, oh, <laughs> random robots just drifting around. Um, yeah, if you guys have been enjoying this, then, uh, yeah, uh, consider subscribing, because, uh, there's literally no reason not to, if you have, a, if you have an account, then, um, yeah, why not? But, oh. Look at all this life. That's a lot of monkeys in a very small space. Um, aren't monkeys... Like, they're social, but aren't they... They live in families, and then they're quite territorial, so I don't think that would make... I don't think that would work very well. Oh, look at this. you got a little, like, deer family. you got Bambi. <laughs> oh, that's nice. How lovely is this? Is it just a buffalo? Just a singular lone buffalo. I'm fairly sure they don't tend to be on their own, do they? They're like moving big herds. What? Oh. What sound was that? Yeah, I'm gonna turn this up so you guys can hear it. What? Oh. That is just. That's a bit ridiculous. <laughs> I don't. I don't think koalas ma quite make you know that, that sound. Um, it's weird because everything sort of blends in here, so it's difficult to see. Because there's rabbits over here, and then you've got wolves over here. Well, they're not called wolves, but they pretty much are wolves. And then you've got people. Just. I think these guys need a little bit more clothing to be wandering around here. But you know, that's their choice. Oh, what's that? Um. Nah, I'll, I'll skip it. I've got the lovely camels. I mean, some of the animals, look, they look really nice, and then others don't. I mean, the snakes, they're decent. Um, uh, the hippo is very smooth, and the... I mean, the rhino's decent, I think, right? Yeah. I mean, you can tell it's a rhino, so, you know, that, that's a good thing. Got the very angry reptiles walking. <laughs> I just, I love their, like, eyebrows. <laughs> oh, we're going through the mountain. Okie dokie. I just love their eyebrows. Look at their face as well. It's like, Rrr. How can they see forwards? <laughs> oh, dear. You gotta love Sword Singularity. Oh, almost didn't see these guys. The bright green? Bright yellow eyes. That is... Well, that doesn't look sinister at all, does it? <laughs> Ugh, blimey. Something I've noticed as well. Why are there so many, like, lizards? I keep seeing them. They're everywhere. I'm fairly sure there are some in here as well, maybe? Possibly? I might just be going crazy. Oh, no, there's loads of koalas here. I think I just... I might just be going crazy. Because I thought I saw loads of, like... Oh, no, look, there's one in here. Lizard. It's floating. Um, uh, okay then. No, that's just, that's straight floating. I can't get a good view on it. Maybe, there we go. That is, um, yeah, that is just, okay, that's a bit of magic right there. <laughs> um, yeah, that's, that's interesting. <laughs> so, see, the thing is, I don't, I don't know what gives you um, the most megabits. If it's 
the humanoid colonist, or the, um, just go all the way up here, the sentient android, or it might be the, um, city, the Martian city, that might be, like, a big one. But something I have wanted to do is to get, like, all of the achievements. Obviously, the entropy achievements are going to be a little bit, uh, a little bit hard, we've got quite a bit more to go with them. Um, but the um, technology achievements, obviously the Martian city, that's going to take a lot of work because they're really expensive. But, because we need, yeah, we need human expeditions upwards. So let's just start with them, eh? Wow, that last, that didn't last long at all. Oh, dear. Okay, so we get some more Martian settlements. You know, you need the expeditions to go to the settlements. Oh, look at that, we've already got an achievement. Mount Olympus. The tallest mountain is the solar system it is Olympus Mons, found on the surface of Mars. It is 21 kilometers tall and has a diameter of 600 kilometers. I don't really use kilometers, so that doesn't mean that much to me. Um, I need miles. <laughs> I need answers. Well, that's, I mean, oh, there you go, look at another achievement. <laughs> hey, a bubble, oh, that's, bubbles of death. The oxygen in their butt blood would literally turn into bubbles, killing them. Why is that for the factory? I, I wouldn't associate a, a Martian factory with bubbles of death. That sounds so sinister. <laughs> My goodness. So, you superhumans, they're cool. Humanoid colonists, I don't see how the humanoid colonists are above superhumans. That's uh, that doesn't feel right to me. Um, got something else to save up for. I always forget, what is Noctilian? How much is that compared to other things? Can we just switch it to scientific? There we go. It has 19 zeros after it. That has 16 zeros after it. Okay, so it's not... That has 34 zeros after it, and that has 42 zeros. <laughs> Oh, goodness, it's so expensive. I mean, the scientific wo uh, mode is quite nice, you know, to see, c to compare everything to each other. You know, if you don't know quite what everything is, you can just see the number on the end, and that's how many zeros it has after it. 4.31 with 30 zeros. I did a bit of research, and apparently, um, the beyond, well, I couldn't really find anything about it. It says coming soon. It's the only real thing that says coming soon. Um, but for some reason, they've done all of this. I suppose this makes more sense. You do the, the lower stuff, right, before you do, you know, like the, the beyond and everything up here. Because I reckon what's going to happen is, because this looks, I mean, nice, right? You have this whole big map you know, look at it. It's it's nice looking. But then you get to this, and it, this has stayed the same since, like, the first time I played, which was, ugh, like, maybe a year ago? This has stayed the same. But this was much, it didn't look nearly this nice. So, that's my thinking, um, is that they're going up in stages, because they, they haven't changed this. And they haven't changed the primordial soup, or the, um, the like solar system, but they changed this one dramatically. So I'm guessing they're going to change this one. I mean, this one it needs changing desperately. It's a bit weird that there's just a random cup on the shelf, eh? Maybe that's one of the secret achievements. <laughs> we don't know. This needs work. I mean, look, it's terrible. It's a terrible-looking table with, like, uh, what's this, like, what's this, like, a diagram of the solar system, um, with a sextant and a big book, <laughs> with, I mean, that's everything here, really, a candle, a uh, sextant, big, thick book, a model of the solar system, a cup on a shelf, a burnt-out fireplace, and some wood. Wow, can I look up around? No, can't even look around. Eek, that's, uh, interesting. The reality engine, this is actually, well, 
it's not new, but it's relatively new, I'd like to say. Um, because it's not, I remember it not being there. I mean, this needs, this needs so much work. <laughs> it's just like three pedestals with a really old looking computer, keyboard and mouse. Um, a tower with some signals coming off. A drone, which really shouldn't be flying with that little mo movement in the rotors. And a train. The train looks the nicest, I think. Look at it. It's, it's lovely. Lovely train. I mean, this needs so much work. Um, they put effort into it, though, you know? But it needs a ridiculous amount of work. Because everything... I mean, with this stuff, it's sort of arranged neatly. But with this, everything's just lined up in a straight line. Separate, like, even distance... Even distances apart. You know, it... it it, the um the color mask doesn't change when this is changed so you know it needs work and uh, I mean I guess this video I've just been going on about the so sort of singularity is just a total of a game um but yeah if you've enjoyed then uh, please do subscribe because uh, we're at 20 and um, you know we've been running at 20 for a while and uh, come on you, do you want to be that one to bump it up? Just bump it up by one subscriber, and then... Because your subscriptions, um, they, they, uh, make me be <laughs> What would be the words? They, uh, yeah, they, they motivate me to make more content and things like this. So, I mean, likes on the video, yeah, I mean, if you want to. I'm not asking for it. We didn't even check out the dinosaurs, bloody hell. Um... Like, you can like the video if you like. <laughs> get, get it? Um, but yeah, so this is going to be... I think this is going to be it for me. So yeah, I'll uh, see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.